Welcome everybody to another Gran Turismo video. This time we're checking out the prize cars from the beginner league on Gran Turismo 3, before we move on to the prize cars from all the other leagues in later videos. Firstly, we start at the familiar Sunday Cup, a Gran Turismo staple since the first game in the series. It features three events at Super Speedway, Midfield and Trial Mountain, and there are no license or vehicle requirements to enter. It's a free-for-all. The prize car is the Toyota Sprinter Truano GT Apex, which comes in either white or red. You can actually purchase this car from the Toyota dealership, but the prize car variant has 127 brake horsepower, in comparison to the dealership version, which has 123 bhp. So although its appearance is nothing unique, there is at least the additional horsepower to make it worthwhile keeping in your garage. Next is the Clubman Cup, another historic event that made its debut in the original Gran Turismo. This time around we visit Rome's Circuit, Special Stage Route 5 and Deep Forest. Two laps of each track. No license or car requirements for this cup either. The prize car is a Mazda MX-5 Miata in sparkle green metallic. This is a unique colour scheme which can only be obtained from winning the Clubman Cup. Also, it has 130 brake horsepower, whereas if it were bought from the dealership, it'd have just 126 bhp. The FF challenge is next up. No license requirements here, although you do need to enter with a car that has an FF drivetrain. Deep Forest, Special Stage Route 5 and Rome Circuit make up the three tracks this time around too. The prize car for the FF challenge is the Toyota Vitz RS 1.5. Not just any Vitz, but the pink Vitz. A Gran Turismo fan favourite thanks to Rhino GT4. This version of the Vitz RS has 109 brake horsepower. Whereas if you bought one from the Toyota dealership, it'd have 105. Four additional horses of power for the price car. We continue with the FR Challenge, which takes place over three races at Grand Valley Speedway, Special Stage Route 5 and Apricot Hill Reverse. Of course, only cars with an FR drivetrain may enter, but you don't need a license to do so. The prize car is the Nissan S13 Silvia Ks in lime green two-tone. You can purchase this car in this colour scheme from the Nissan dealership, but like with the other prize cars, this Silvia gets a small horsepower boost. The prize car version has 172 bhp, whereas the dealership version has 167. After the FR challenge, our next event to tackle is the MR challenge, which features three races at Trial Mountain, Deep Forest and Apricot Hill. No license requirements, just the drivetrain restriction here again. The prize car is the Toyota MRS S edition, which comes equipped with 138 brake horsepower and it's in blue Mika. The car and colour scheme are purchasable from the Toyota dealership, but once again, the prize car version has a horsepower advantage. 138 to 133 at the dealership. Three events make up the four-wheel drive challenge on Gran Turismo 3. Deep Forest, Midfield and Special Stage Route 11, two laps each. You don't need your B licence to enter, just a four-wheel drive car. The prize car is a Suzuki Alto Works Suzuki Sport Limited, which comes in a unique colour, gold metallic. It also has 63 brake horsepower as standard, compared to 61 bhp when bought from the dealership. The lightweight sports car cup is up next, with races at Trial Mountain, Super Speedway and Laguna Seca. Still no licence required, but you are restricted to just three cars you can enter with the Daihatsu Mira, the Suzuki Alto Works and the Mini Cooper. In fact, the Mini Cooper 1.3i is the prize car for this event, and it comes in 10 different colours. We have Nightfire Red, Flame Red, Volcano
Amaranth. Tahiti Blue. Almond Green. British Racing Green. Hawaiian Blue. Surf blue. And anthracite. As you cannot purchase this car at a dealership, since there is no mini dealership, there's no horsepower advantage with the prize car mini. The Stars and Stripes Championship is up next, featuring American cars only. Although once again you don't need a license to enter. The prize car is a Chevrolet Camaro SS, with no unique colour scheme this time. But like with other prize cars we've seen so far, there is a small horsepower advantage to winning it as a prize car rather than buying it from the Chevrolet dealership. The prize car Camaro has 326 bhp, whereas the dealership version has just 316. The Spider and Roach the Championship is up next in the beginner league, and it also doesn't require you to have your B license to enter. This championship is essentially for soft top cars, however no car actually races with its top down on Gran Turismo 3, to my knowledge at least. Anyway, the prize car is the Mazda Miata MX-5 LS in a unique colour, Sunburst Yellow. It has 160 brake horsepower, which is more than you get when you buy the car from the Mazda dealership just 156 bhp for that one. The 80 Sports Car Cup is the first championship that actually requires you to have your B license. And as the name suggests, it features cars from the 1980s. You'll be racing at Special Stage Route 5, Tokyo Route 246 Reverse and Seattle Circuit Reverse. And the prize car is, fittingly, a car from the 80s. The Mazda RX-7 Infini 3. The colour awarded is Shadow Silver Mika, which isn't unique, but again you do get a little bit of an additional horsepower boost. 209bhp for the price car, and 202 when bought from the dealership. Now we turn our attention to the race of NA Sports, featuring naturally aspirated cars only, at Apricot Hill, Grand Valley Speedway and Apricot Hill Reverse. The Honda CRX Del Sol SIR is the price car, in the following colours. Milano Red, Flint Black Metallic, Vogue Silver Metallic, Captivate Blue Pearl, and Samba Green Pearl. All these colours are available to buy from the dealership, but you do get 165 horsepower, compared to 160 when you buy it from the Honda dealership. The race of Turbo Sports is next, featuring cars that can be equipped with a turbocharger and you'll race at midfield, test course and special stage route 11. The prize car is the Daihatsu Mira TRXX Avanzato R, in either silver metallic, black metallic or pure white. All three colours are available to purchase from the Daihatsu dealership, but while the dealership version has 61 horsepower, the prize car has 63. Two extra horses of power. The five race series of Taurus Trophy is next up, and no, it's not a championship for bikes, but for Audi TTs only. You'll race at Rome, Laguna Seca, Trial Mountain, Special Stage Route 11 and Côte d'Azur. And the price car is an Audi TT in one of four unique colours. 
yellow. Blue. Green metallic. And red metallic. When bought new, the TT has 214 bhp, while the price car has 221. A nice increase. Our next championship is the Legend of Silver Arrow, Mercedes-Benz cars only. Three races here, at Test Course, Trial Mountain Reverse and Rome Circuit Reverse. The price car is, surprising nobody, a Mercedes-Benz. And it's actually a Mercedes-Benz SLK 230 compressor in any of the following colours. Brilliant Silver Metallic Obsidian Black Metallic Black Firm White Yellowstone Magma Red Amber Red Metallic Vivianite Green Metallic and Linarite Blue Metallic All these colours are available to purchase at the Mercedes-Benz dealership. So the only unique quality about this car is its horsepower. 192 for the price car, and 186 when bought from the dealership. We come now to the Altezza race, a Series 4 Toyota Altezza's ran over 5 races at Midfield, Tokyo R246, Deep Forest, Special Stage Route 5, and Seattle Circuit. For the prize car, you either get awarded a Toyota Celica SS2 ST202 in one of three colours, or a new Toyota Celica SS2 in a unique colour. So it can actually be quite difficult to get the unique colour, which is likely to be the prize car you want the most. Starting with the older Celica SS2, the potential colours are Super Red 5, Super White 2, and black. All three are available to buy as standard from the Toyota dealership, but the price car again has a small brake horsepower boost, 181 for the price car and 175 when purchased. The newer Toyota Celica SS2 is awarded to you in Chalcedony Blue Pearl, a unique colour scheme, and a very nice one too. It has 185 bhp as well, while the dealership variant has 180. Ok, only a handful of events left in the beginner league. Onto the Vitz Yaris race, restricted of course to the Toyota Yaris or Vitz, which is the same car and has different names in different regions. This five race series visits Rome Circuit, Laguna Seca, Tokyo R246, Trial Mountain and Special Stage Route 5. The price car is... what else? A Toyota Vitz or Yaris RS 1.5. One of the possible colour schemes is pink again, which reappears from the FF challenge. However, it's joined by three other colour schemes we haven't yet seen. Orange Metallic, yellow and cyan again it comes with 109 horsepower whereas the dealership version has 105 Okay, four events left in the beginner league now, the first of these being the Type R meeting, for Honda and Acura Type R cars. 
It's a five race series run as a championship rather than standalone events. Held at Tokyo Route 246, Grand Valley Speedway, Trial Mountain Reverse, Super Speedway, and Tokyo Route 246 Reverse. The price car is the Acura RSX Type S, which comes in one of eight colours. You can view the RSX at the Acura dealership, but you can't buy it. So the only way to access the car in these colour schemes is to win it. The colours are... Arctic Blue Eternal Blue Pearl Taffeta White Premium White Nighthawk Black Fire Pepper Red Satin Silver and Desert Silver Up next is the Evolution Meeting, which is a competition reserved for the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution. It's a three race event held at Laguna Seca, Trial Mountain and Midfield Reverse, two laps at each circuit. The prize car is, you guessed it, the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution. But not just any Evo. It's an Evo 4 in dandelion yellow, which is a unique colour for this car as you can't buy it at the Mitsubishi dealership. The prize car Evo 4 has 271 horsepower, whereas the dealership version has just 263. The penultimate event of the beginner league is the Beetle Cup, where you're restricted to entering with a Volkswagen Beetle. Although you'll be up against a load of Beetle Cup cars, the prize car for this event is actually a Volkswagen New Beetle RSI. However, the good news is that this car only comes in one colour scheme an unnamed silver colour which was later revealed to be Silver Arrow Metallic. So you only need to complete this event once. It comes with 225 brake horsepower, which is more than you get when you buy it from the VW dealership, 218 bhp. Last, but by absolutely no means least, we have the Gran Turismo World Championship. You'll need your A licence to compete in this 10 race series held at... Tokyo at Route 246, Super Speedway, Trial Mountain, Midfield, Laguna Seca, Seattle Circuit, Special Stage Route 11, Apricot Hill Raceway, Trial Mountain Reverse, and Grand Valley Speedway. There are four different prize cars to win, some in multiple colours, so you'll have to complete this event a few times if you want to collect all of them. The first potential prize car is the Toyota Celica GT4 ST205. It's awarded to the player in a unique colour scheme, Orange Mika Metallic, and has 251 bhp, compared to 243 bhp when bought. The second possible prize car is the Nissan R32 Skyline GTR V-Spec 2, which comes in three unique colour schemes that cannot be bought from the Nissan dealership. The first of these is an unnamed blue colour. 
The second is active red. And last, we have Silica Breath Metallic. When bought new, the Skyline has 297 brake horsepower, whereas the price car has 307, a nice increase of 10 bhp. The third potential price car is the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 6 GSR, which comes in a unique colour scheme, Dandelion Yellow, just like the Evo 4 we just won previously. It comes with the usual horsepower advantage too. 312 for the price car, compared to 302 when bought from the dealership. The last prize car that can be awarded from the GT World Championship is the Mazda MX-5 Miata, which can come in four unique colour schemes. Blaze Red. Evolution Orange Mika. Sunburst Yellow and Supreme Blue Mika. The price car variant has 118 bhp, while the dealership model has 114. But there's actually one last prize car in the Beginners League, and it's awarded to the player when you fully complete all the events in the Beginner League. The car in question is the Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution 5 GSR, in another unique colour scheme, Neyes Blue Pearl. It has 306 bhp too, while the dealership version has 297. And with that, we come to the end of the prize cars from the beginner league in Gran Turismo 3. Thanks for watching, and see you for more prize cars soon.